Hey folks, remember this? Today, we're gonna make something with them. Stay tuned. The recipe we're gonna make today is from Wanella1946. Check the link to his channel in the description box below. Hope you enjoy. First, you're going to need to peel and devein at least eight ounces of shrimp. If you're on the same diet I am and you're using the faux rice, you're going to need a cooking sheet to roast the cauliflower rice in. In a large bowl, set 16 to 24 ounces of your cauliflower rice. Mix with three to four tablespoons of olive oil. Add salt and black pepper. and a couple of tablespoons of your Cajun seasoning. Place a sheet of aluminum foil on your cooking sheet. Non-stick aluminum foil will work best. If you don't have it, you can use a regular sheet of aluminum foil like I am here and simply coat the bottom with uh, oil or cooking spray of some sort. Place in oven at 350 for 10 to 15 minutes. While that's happening, you can chop one large onion. a large red bell pepper. The recipe in the directions said red bell pepper specifically. I don't suppose it really matters. I mean, they all taste like bell peppers, but red makes a nice appearance and bell peppers don't come in, you know, blue. You're also going to need to chop two stalks of celery. And four links of andouille sausage. You want to cut the sausage in half and then chop into quarters.
coat a large skillet with olive oil. Add in your onions to cook down first. After your onions have rendered for a while, add in your bell pepper and celery. Cook over medium heat until tender. While those vegetables are cooking down, it's time to pay some attention to the star of the show. Take your bluegill fillets and chop into bite-sized chunks. Add a tablespoon of Hungarian paprika. Now normally I'm too lazy to crush garlic and I just buy the stuff already minced in the jar. My wife had made homemade ramen for Father's Day and we had some garlic cloves left over. So though I'm normally lazy, lazy come to find out is a close second to cheap. Now you want to add your andouille sausage and let that cook down for a while. Though the directions didn't ask me to do this, I decided to add some of the Cajun seasoning to the vegetable mix so I get the seasoning throughout the dish. Now you want to add a 15 ounce can of petite diced tomatoes. Yes, the directions said petite specifically. Not exactly sure why, but they were the same price, so I got the petite. Time to add in our shrimp that we deveined and peeled. And finally, our bluegill that we caught, filleted, chopped, and now cooked.
Reduce heat to medium low. Let your significant other work on their Instagram game. Cover and let cook for 10 minutes or until shrimp is pink and the bluegill are flaky. After stirring the shrimp and fish in well on the reduced heat, now it's time to add our cauliflower rice. Add your desired level of hot sauce of your choosing, Tabasco or otherwise, depending on how hot or spicy you enjoy the dish. Plate and serve. I think you're really going to enjoy this one. We ended up loving it. Before you go, be sure and click that subscribe button. Smash that thumbs up if you like this video. Leave a comment in the comment box below. And click that notification bell to stay tuned for all our uploads. Thanks for watching. Tight lines. Ah, Clean Plate Club.